Hey boys and girls, I'm Alex from thetechnoclass.com and we're checking out the Cherry Mobile Magnum HD. Uh, this is the one of the uh, flagship phones of Cherry Mobile maybe a little early on, uh, maybe early this year, yes. Um, which has been replaced by the Magnum 2X, a dual core one, but this is still pretty good. It has a larger screen, uh, one gigahertz processor and everything. So it also has a front-facing camera, but um, I know what you're going to ask. Uh, Skype video does not support this phone just yet, but you can use it for other functions like, you know, mirrors and taking pictures of yourself or other uh, video-enabled apps. But let's go ahead and unbox it. There. So, okay. Somebody left a chocolate bar in the box of a Mag Magnum HD. Oops, alright, so actually I was lying, that was actually the Magnum HD. Um, yeah, it was a striking design, but we'll get to that later. So, take out the top of the box. The top of the box is foam, so that's nice. Um, but, oops, sorry. Uh, you get a battery. This is a 1400 milliamp hour battery and we'll pop it in and boot up the phone just in case There we go So slide this down. We'll talk about the hardware stuff later and Put the battery in like this like this like this And slide it up there we go so booting it up There we go. Uh, inside the box you get a charger. Uh, can't really see here. Let's see. Switching charger, 100 to 240 volts, so it's auto volt. Only one type of plug, the, uh, the horizontal or vertical lined up ones. Um, you get a USB cable for your charger, obviously. And a headset. So yeah, it's got a button, and yeah, it looks nice. Uh, on the bottom here, we have, ah, that's it, just a quick start guide. Uh, nice color one, yep, and that's about it. So this phone comes with, uh, originally comes with Android 2.2 Froyo. Froyo. This phone originally comes with Android 2.2 Froyo, but Cherry Mobile has a... Uh, man, that thing is reflective. You can, you can see it in my room here. Um, Cherry Mobile have come up with a, an update, the gingerbread update for this phone. So, uh, But this comes out of the box in Froyo form. We'll, be able to, we'll give you a, a quick video on how to update your uh, Cherry Mobile Magnum HD later on. Maybe in a, tomorrow or something. But... For now, this is what it looks like when you come when it comes out of the box. This is a 4.1 inch. That's pretty big. 4.1 inch, uh, 800 by 480 display. It's not high resolution, higher resolution than um, some high-end phones, but it's also the same resolution as high-end phones. Uh, you get a. This is probably the VGA front-facing camera. That's a speaker grill here. There's a LED light there for notifications and a bunch of sensors on the right. On the bottom you have uh, the Android capacitive buttons. This is back, menu, home, and search. Plus a small microphone here, which you'll see. It's, uh, it's like a lip. Alright, so that's about it for the front. On the bottom, you'll see something very interesting. Um, so on the left here is your regular charging charging ports and this is a curious um, addition this is an HDMI D port for outputting to your uh, HD TV not a lot of phones have this and they kind of forgot about it so it's a nice addition doesn't come with the HDMI D cable though so you'll have to buy on your own uh, on the right side it's just a volume rocker um, on this side is the power unlock button and that's about it. Oh, should we should mention that the speakers are over here, left and right side. 
Uh, it's a nice, um, <laughs> nice uh, slot, slit. Uh, this is not age appropriate video. Um, slot, nice area for your speakers there. And um, on top, you have your 3.5 millimeter headset jack. On the back is a Cherry Mobile badge, a metal backing plate. Sorry, that doesn't sound right. Alright, so this looks like a metal backing plate that's really nice. And uh, your micro SD slot here and your SIM slot there. It's not dual SIM. A lot of people have asked, but it's not dual SIM. Uh, on another part of the back here is a, a slightly bit pr protruding uh, 5 megapixel camera and LED flash. So let's spot. The cover comes on by sliding it down or up, which leaves a slightly unusual uh, edge there where you could might kill yourself. No, not really. You won't kill yourself, but maybe. No paper cuts there. Just a little bit something to feel when you're holding the phone. Uh, the phone is pretty big. Um, I know that the, the norm for high-end phones these days have been pretty big. But when you actually feel one in the hand, it's also pretty big. So this is the Orbit. It's kind of dirty, but this is the Orbit in comparison. And as you can see, it's a lot taller, a lot bigger. And um, though the Orbit is a lot thicker, um, the design itself looks like it's uh, it's like a candy, like a chocolate bar. It's, uh, it's completely almost flat and rounded on the corners um, top and bottom is just completely uh, flat as well so it looks like actually it looks like a cigarette holder remember and um, this looks like the part where the uh, the lighter comes out you flick this and uh, a torch comes out where you light your cigarettes but it's not actually a cigarette lighter or it also looks like a business card holder but it's a, a little bit bigger um, so I, we think that's uh, part of the design to make it look that way so it's flat and um, slate looking it's more like a it doesn't look like a phone it more looks it looks more like a, a media player really but it is a phone so let's check out the UI here for a bit uh, I'm sh been wasting too much time talking about the design and so this is a regular well, not super stock Android. It does have some customizations, but um, it uh, most of the parts look stock, like uh, the home screens and the menu. So as you can see, it's just up, down menu and side scroll for for the um, home screens. You get five home screens, and uh, the difference here that we noticed so far is that the unlock screen is a little different. Uh, there are a bunch of shortcuts here. One is the regular unlock. And a bunch of short shortcuts to uh, unlock the phone directly to the app on uh, being shown here. Um, we're, we're pretty sure you can customize that if you want, but haven't tried it yet, so we'll see. Uh, this is, of course, going to be updated to Gingerbread, so we're not sure if uh, the same UI will be there. Uh, something to note as well is the camera app. It looks a little different. So let's see here. Um, the camera and camcorder apps look a, look a little bit different. So as you can see, um, there are some settings here and there. Uh, there are some nice features here with um, face detection, which we tested and it looks it worked pretty good. Um, but it's not the stock um, uh, Android camera, uh, which is which may or may not be good. So we'll tr we'll try it out and tell you what we think. Uh, it's got 720p video recording, 5 megapixel camera with LED flash. Um, so yeah, it looks uh, promising, and we'll we'll like to see, we'll let you know what we think in the review. All right, so that's about it for the Cherry Mobile Magnum HD. Um, we'd like you to note that this phone now retails for only uh, 11,999, I believe, and it's very cheap for a single core, one gigahertz processor with a very large screen. And it's, it will be all up to the review if it can live up to that expectation. 
Um, so hopefully um, you can stay tuned and check out our review when it comes up. This is the Cherry Mobile Magnum HD. I'm Alex from thetechnoclass.com. Thanks for watching and hit that button up there to subscribe. Hey boys and girls, uh, today... Hey boys and girls, today... <laughs> hey boys and girls, I'm Alex from thetechnoclass.com and today we're checking out the Cherry Mobile Magnum HD. I can't talk like this for the entire time. <laughs>